Devonta Saponis and Jared Allen have stepped to the center circle. The uh, tip is won by the Cavaliers, and we are underway. Sabonis off to McDermott, around the horn it goes. Sumner keeps it moving. Lavert for three. That young man is a great story. I love to see him back on the floor. Here is Lavert for his last two games. 66 combined points, 26 rebounds for the former net. Brissett to the bucket. Will miss his sixth straight with a sore hamstring. Jeremy Lamb will miss his 16th game with a sore knee as McDermott to the bucket. He gives the Pacers a 7-2 lead. To stay with Collin, and that's a pretty tough task for a big man. Adds six and a half assists per game to his line as Sexton beats Sabonis to the basket. He lays it in. Does that stand out in many of the Cavaliers' minds? In that last meeting, Levert down the lane, stops, floats, and scores. McConnell, obviously, been in the Pac-12 as the head coach of the Cal Golden Bears women's basketball team. And, boy, we're certainly thrilled for Lindsay as McDermott lays it up and in. Uh, to the Cavaliers organization, and uh, she will definitely be missed. Jared Allen in the paint. Rebounded by Sexton. Sexton banks and scores, gets fouled. And Colin Sexton has a chance for the three-point play. He's guarded by Levert. Allen wants it, he gets it low post, has his tail into Sabonis, hooks and scores. Yeah, and that's where they have to start doing more of. Almost play just like him, up and down the floor all the time. Set aside a couple of two ways, recently a standard contract. Allen launches a three and knocks it down. The big man comes straight away. Sumner in the corner, looks to go baseline, try to shovel to Sabonis, threw it wide. Here goes Sexton, Laverts the lone man back. Sexton fires a three, got it. Coming down with confidence. Turn in mid-March, and, and geez, what a story, AC, that puts everything in perspective. Yes, it does. A great story. And this young man, you have to take your hat off to him because that's what the Cavaliers have to keep in mind. They have been involved in just some wild affairs over the last few games. And Dean Wade hits a turnaround. A lot of old-school references here early for you, AC, <laughs> in this yeah. first quarter of play. Wade toward the bucket, uses the glass on Brissett. Holiday McConnell, Brissett, Sabonis, and Lavert for the visiting Pacers. Okoro finds Thomas, fakes a three, right to the basket. An aggressive move by Thomas, he exploded to the rim. Thomas this season with the Canton Charge finished third in the year. Rookie of the Year voting in the G League. McConnell spins and scores. Yeah, he had a solid first quarter, really got the Cavs back into this game with, with his play. Cavadelli with the offensive rebound gets fouled by Bataze and has a chance for the three-point play. Nate Bjorken has already gone 10 deep as Thomas once again streaks to the bucket and lays it home. Cavs secure the turnover. And the Cavs give it back. McConnell. Martin runs the floor. Their other brother Drew, you may have heard of him, he plays in Milwaukee with the Bucks. Cabin Gelly, another three, got it. Akuro to the elbow, back to Thomas, fakes the three, got Lavert to bite. Akuro with three on the shot clock, launches a long distance three, and knocks it down. Yes, believe me, he's had a spectacular season. I mean, he has really developed into a, a very good point guard in this league. Ano Holiday and Martin are on the floor for the visiting Pacers. Martin got. Cavaliers Martin on a flyby and uh, Keelan lays it in. Didn't really, didn't really think he could see the guy coming in behind him. Another steal. McConnell, Holiday, Martin. Three straight buckets for Martin, and uh, not surprisingly, JB Bickerstaff says enough of that. Eight points, nine boards in this first half. Triple double threat every night is Sabonis as Lavert works his way to the bucket. He has a team high 11 to go along with five assists. The Pacer run is the 11-0 as Indiana has taken this 47-46 lead. Sixth and cruises to the basket. So I've been campaigning for Turner to be named Defensive Player of the Year. As Lavert knocks down a 15-footer. Lavert now has 13. This number here, because if it keeps going like this, Cavs going to have to really offensively come up with it or have good defensive plays like this and score on the run as Sexton throws the hammer down. Sexton, 18-footer, missed the shot. Loose ball grabbed by Allen. Three seconds left. There's a Coro. He's got it. That's exactly what he's doing. He said, I'm not going to let you guys falter here in this third quarter. You're gonna, I'm going to keep your focus. Sexton to the bucket, puts it up and in. 
It's a bonus straight away. Hands off to McDermott, catch and shoot three. He's got it. That's what he does. That's what he does. That's his shot. Bonus grabs his 13th rebound. He'll lumber into the forecourt. McDermott, now Lavert. Lavert, quick step to the basket. They take a lot of strange shots. A coral creeps baseline and hammers it home. Bonus fakes a handoff, keeps his dribble. Now finds Brissett. Brissett yeah. with an answer. We're tied at 68. Brissett guards a coral. A coral off a of Kevin Gelly screen to the bucket. Skidded. It was blocked by Sabonis. Shot clock down to two. Wade long three. Here comes Okoro. Okoro all the way to the basket, lays it up and in to give the Cavaliers a 73-68 a lead. Wade with the free throw. Meanwhile, here Sabonis deals off to McConnell. Back to Lavert. Lavert with a three. Trims the uh, Cavalier lead to three. McConnell off to Lavert. Stops. Deals back up top to Martin. Keelan Martin drains a three and ties this game at 74. On the carousel, keeps his dribble, sends it back to Sabonis. McConnell, baseline, and the Pacers have taken the lead. Go as the current Pacer runs. Sabonis never saw Dean Wade. Pointed to his ears as if to say, somebody's got to tell me he's coming. Exactly. Jeremiah Martin, got it! Martin has given the Cavs a 77-76 lead. Sabonis has an answer. <laughs> you could tell he was getting a little frustrated. Keep up the defensive pressure here in the fourth step two AC. Make a couple of shots. And that's going to be the key. They have to make shots. As Adam does a good job of following up the shot and knocking it in. Because the Pacers, that's the only thing they know how to do. Allen with the aggressive follow. McConnell tough off balance. Shot, he gets the roll and... Puts the Pacers back on top. Allen almost had that one himself with the, the follow-up. I started to say the Cavs have only eight available bodies tonight. For those of you who joined us late, as Justin Holiday on the floor for the Cavs. Dotson weaves to the top of the key. Now to Sexton. Here's a Coro. He knocks it down. Doing a good job of moving the ball. Sexton made the extra pass. And Okoro is deep in the rock. Out of the corner comes Keelan Martin. He floats and scores. Martin gives the Pacers an 86-83 lead. McConnell relays one, finds Martin. Keelan Martin has been a huge goodness. for the Pacers. 18 points. That's a hesitation move underneath. Keeps his dribble. Shot clock all the way down to one. Contested jumper. Oh, <laughs> my. The ball is inbounded to Sabonis. McConnell, oh, back boy. door, guess who? It's Keelan Martin. You can't turn your back on the ball. Cavs, despite shooting 36%, are hanging in there. Okoro for three. It creeps over the front of the rim, and Isaac Okoro now has 19 points to go along with 10 board. Lavert way short. Okoro defended. Again, the Cavs are making the Pacers work. Okoro leaks out and ties this game at 91. Cavaliers doing a good job of running the whole court. It's really starting to look very solid out there and confident on the offensive end. Meanwhile, 6.15 to go. 91 apiece. Sabonis inside. Banks and scores. Sabonis. Mother guard. Sacks into the bucket. Doesn't go down. And Miles Turner out of the lineup here. Sabonis inside. His big night continues. Allen back to her cut. And it knocked away by Lavert. The Patriots have the ball in a five-point lead. Sabonis off to Martin. Keelan Martin has 23. Allen pressured out around the perimeter by an aggressive Sabonis. Sexton relays the Wade catch and shoot. He rattles it in. Lavert has 20 points tonight. Off to Martin. Martin's the high pacer. Goes to the bucket, lays it up, and lays it in. 25 now for Keelan Martin. Wow. Wade has played 37 big minutes tonight. A core of 41. He's at the top of the chart. McConnell. And that will do it. Final thoughts, AC. The Pacers win this one.